Uh, yes, my uh, streaming minutes from Chess24 commitment are going to be deducted. <coughs> 9.30, I'll start I the timer. <laughs> I thought that you're supposed to castle first. Did Maxim mix up his prep again, or is his prep to play this? Because I, I know the line with short castle, and then depending on the knight, 92, knight of 3, I do different things. I haven't looked at this forever. In the old like days, you went castle, 92, c5. Yeah. And, uh, 92, yeah. you can go b5. That's not, some, that depends on the stuff. But knight of 3, you can go c5, yeah. which is very, very trendy. But, um, but Maxim goes for just b5 in either case. I think that's also probably possible. They're following some game... Dubov, Nepomnishi, <laughs> where... I think they're following the game every Carlson and Vl from Tenerife today, no? <laughs> <laughs> that too. one too. But now knight c6, this is the improvement. He now follows Nepomnishi. He played bishop g4 in the classical, which is... Oh, is, is that... Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. But, but uh, how is... Did he get better after this? Was Magnus Blunder some move or what happened there? Um, yeah, it was more... Step by step, I think. Well... Okay. Bishop okay, four rook c8. Okay, this is the classical mm -hmm. here. H3, the computer didn't like it. So bishop e3, and why is better? Uh -huh. Well, after h3, black is somehow in time. Uh, and then he and no, didn't want to pull the brakes too early. And yeah. Yeah, to yeah, pull the brakes. He was trying to uh, keep it complicated, but it got worse. But now, something different happened. Rook b1, knight c6, pawn to e5. Yeah, so this is different it's from so the game. so ugly what he, black is doing now. Bishop f5, really? And rook b8, first of all, looks a bit passive. Bishop e4. Ah, rook b8, okay, at least the pawn is not hanging. And bishop f5. Bishop f5 is such an ugly move, Jesus Christ. So okay, so you take that one, presumably? He did, yeah. It must be terrible, right? What's his idea? Mm. I mean, is his idea... I mean, I don't understand. No, apparently... He just wants to again. keep the pawn alive. Compi running here says dc5 is the best move, which looks counterintuitive as well. But then this black is okay, no? Uh, zero, 70 or not? 70? Uh -huh. After queen d1, d1, knight e5? It's not okay? It looks very, very, very little. 94 is quite okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it, intuitively it feels like yeah. it's drawish, you know? Yeah. Some e6, rook c8, some... Like, I wouldn't think dc is the thing, but of course you are really happy to keep the bishop on this own. Queen d3 looks normal now, attacking Yes, Yeah, I, mm. I, I'm curious if Magnus in, uh, in a rapid game uh, is able to play dc. dc is the kind of move that is very hard for people like me, but he can, of course, yeah. pull it off sometimes. Um, the computer's second choice is actually to develop the bishop to a3, but I agree, you know, so now that the king has been opened up, I mean, I would be looking just one direction. Yeah, you, you think that something there yeah, happens. Uh, mm -hmm. And uh, bishop a3 is also a neat tactic, because after before you've got queen a4. Yeah, queen d3, of course, yeah, that's, that's the move yeah, we all would make. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. No, queen d7, zeros. Ah, ah, yeah, because e6 is not good, yeah? Because of some bishop g5. Six, I guess we take. Uh. Oh, bishop g5, knight e5? No, no, then knight e5, knight e5. Ah, just take on b5. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ah, because I'm not in time. So cd first, and if cd first, cd first, and then e6? Mm, that's possible. Uh. But after cd, apparently queen f5 is good. Uh. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's not surprising. So knight g5, just checkmate. That's quite yes. obvious, yeah. Just missed that. Okay. Yeah. Well, queen d7, queen okay, Maxim will, will, have, will have to do it. You'll we'll have to do it. You'll have to make it. Not that difficult to move, also. No, but I have to say the computer does say that after pawn takes pawn, he is surviving after queen takes e f5, mm. but it looks ugly. Yeah, you, it just looks like you're not surviving, to be honest. Like, I, mean, I don't see the, the line. That, what is the line? So the, the line is basically that uh, once e6... Queen e4, no, even? I am yeah, queen, queen d5 and he's... Okay, queen but e4. I mean, okay, takes cd, it looks completely lost, this position. No? <laughs> totally. Bishop e3, rook c1, it just looks lost. lost. Yeah. Yeah, like this, surviving is okay. Also, our get done with three minutes less. It's good luck. Yep. And uh, talking about the time control, uh, Maxim has uh, just over four and a half minutes, so lots of time, whilst Magnus is still nurturing his time advantage, and he has over seven and a half minutes. The three minutes, always good to, to watch out for the three minutes. Yeah, like, so, so now, again, the three minute advantage is restored. That's good news for White. As long as you keep that three minutes, that, that means that things are going very mm -hmm. well time-wise. Yeah, I think he will have to find queen to seven by elimination. It's just strange it takes him that long, but he will make it. There's no other move. There he comes. Of course. It comes. Yeah, you just, it's just basic uh, calculation for Maxim. Mm -hmm. You ro rule out all the other moves, and then you, you find this one. And uh, now, well, Magnus has to find Super the point four, of attack. Uh, rook d1 as well, yeah. Rook d1 played. Magnus being in a must-win situation. I like rook his chances, yeah. I've seen the worst positions for white and Armageddon being one. Rook d8. Bishop f4. Bishop f4. Queen e3, then shuffle bishop to h6 and try to. So, so. 
give few checks, gain more time, mm -hmm. then flag him. <laughs> That's how all, most of the games are here and no, just by flagging, I think. Yeah, essentially. Well, essentially. I feel like essentially. there are your downtime and people Essentially flagging, uh, people are yeah. just collapsing. So uh, it's, it's a nice uh, format. I think it's really good. You've got the classical chess where people are, uh, you know, looking like, like old-fashioned, come up with interesting ideas in the opening, play interesting games. And then for action, you just end all the games with flagging. I think that's quite nice. Yep. <laughs> pawn takes pawn. Oh, you know, we think that uh, there's something to be said for just having a tournament of Armageddon's. Yeah, for yeah, sure, for sure. Yeah, with double the, the prices. Chase. Double the prices. Yeah. Because uh, double, you know, for people, they <laughs> <laughs> so much stress. No, but you don't have to play the classical, just five Armageddon's per day. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's why, I, uh, <laughs> how to say, how to say times five? Like, you have, I know quadruple and then quintuple. Quintuple, 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 quintuple yeah. the money. Uh -huh. Wow. Uh -huh. Yeah. That's going to be a nice tournament, juicy prize fund. Five Armageddon's a day. <laughs> Some, uh, By the 60, end of it, you'll need a prize. good holiday. Yeah, yeah. And, 300k uh, first prize. Yep. And uh, just to remind everyone of the time control, so there is no increment until the players reach move 40. No, and this rook b5? Sorry, rook b5, rook b5, king b5, knight e5 thing. Um, mm -hmm. I didn't realize that uh, you're still going on about the time control because this is quite complicated, so it takes time to yeah. explain your time control. Yeah, yeah. and I before as well, but also take 95. Yeah, and yeah, we should have six. I like that. I like that. Yep, I like that too. And uh, old followed by h4, h5, queen g5. h6 probably now, yeah? yeah. h6. Old, old like fashioned. Fine. <laughs> old fashioned. Uh, yeah. It's, it's h6 putzers. H6 yeah, so okay, good. queen f4 on the board. I mean, maybe there's ideas of actually just trying to bulldoze the black pawn structure by just going g4, h4. I'm a big fan of h4. I think the first try would be to go some just direct mate, and then if that doesn't work, we'll switch to the, the pawn storm. Normally, you try to mate by, by pieces. And ninety six. Ninety six. It just needs to attack long enough to get into the flagging, no? Like, yeah. uh, objectively, black's fine. Mm -hmm. So, eight. yeah, there's rook g8. Now you can take on d5. Oh, nice. Not d5 yes. directly. D5. Uh, d5 is pretty. So, okay, pawn takes pawn. Is that also strong or is it just pretty? Mm. Mine is 0 0.50, so it's not uh -huh. just pretty. Actually, yeah, it's pretty. Actually just pretty. Black can just simply capture the pawn and Maxim has done that. Oh, there's a Sushinsuk, bishop g7, f4, Sushinsuk. Oh, oh, he missed Ooh. that. That's why he should have taken on g7 first. Yeah. Oh, that's so dirty, so unfair. Oh, okay, this so unfair. Yeah. Oof. It didn't happen yet, but... But that, it's not going to happen. That's why it's, Queen h3 is going to go but probably. Okay. But is this so bad for... Yeah, it's very bad. No winning chances at all. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. he has to play whatever. Rook queen h4, queen h3, four, queen h3 some move. I think he'll go queen h3. At least to threaten something. I mean, can he go um, h4? Yeah. Uh, you know, uh, tuck four the queen, queen h2, on h2. Yeah. 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 Oof. Nice. yeah, but then queen g4 and it's like... Queen h2, <laughs> nice, yes. You're attacking your own king instead. Instead of attacking the... Pairing queen h4. Uh, rook b4, yeah. 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 Stylish. Rook, rook d4. Rook c4. Rook c4. Ah, oh, then take the e6 somewhere. Ah, right? there's some, e6. some loose rook. Yeah, Mago's playing stylish chess. That's how you should play Armageddon's. But is it, yeah, e6 is not a problem. E6 is not a problem, yeah? E6 f4 or something or what? Rook b4 on the board, rook c4, but I'm okay. You can take an e6, yeah. e6 not a problem, Maxim? f4, queen takes g6, and f4, queen g6 is not working. Six played. Wow, he just takes. Wow, wait, what? Ah, exchange like, it's not so bad. Nice, it's very good. After bishop takes bishop, you've got f4 again. Again. And queen b8, bishop c isn't it great for black? This is great for black. Looks and uh, even better than that. Zero, zero, zero. So it's, pos it's still possible to soften up the pawns somehow. Uh, maybe black king is slightly weak, but it's really a, a long-term thing. Safe, right? Because yeah. all the pieces are around it, bishop and the knight. Yeah, I think that, to be honest, I would think that black is just rolling and Maxim is, uh, Maxim is very happy. Magnus is thinking that he's messing mm -hmm. it up. And uh, okay, let's uh, always remind ourselves of the clock situation because Maxim just has two minutes remaining, whilst Magnus, okay, he has five. He has so that three, three minute lead. It's following the Giri rule. <laughs> yeah. Except, except at some point, Maxim will have like uh, 30 seconds. Magnus, three minute 30, and he will resign the game. And <laughs> I feel like. Yeah. Okay. The rook moves to e one attacking. Queen six is nicely, nicely the the square. Yeah. Do you want to go to controls everything? Yeah, he's about ah, to okay, queen except queen d7. F7 pawn. F7 pawn is nice. Yeah, it's important. Queen okay, d7 is good. Yeah, yeah. and nice. uh, will black better. start uh, rolling down the pawns? Yes, Chucky likes to show, you know. Just, <laughs> just uh, the pawn is, yeah, it's hopeless. It's hopeless. Yeah, but okay. The d4, clock. d3, c3, d2, c2. And what's it like playing with this one second increment? Is it just 
I mean, it's a little, you flag a little bit easier than with 10 second increment, but you still flag. It's uh, basically the same thing. Mm -hmm. yeah. One second is, the, is, you know, like when you're kind of uh, drowning completely and mm -hmm. you give this very thin, very, very thin, <laughs> not even wooden stick, this chopstick you give, and you're like, <laughs> grab it. Oh, you just still drowned. Okay, well, we, we, gave, we, gave you, we gave you a stick, you know, but I don't know why you didn't hold on to it. It was a stick. Yeah, it's a very thin one. Yeah, but it was a stick, so you know. Yeah, why and you grab uh, it? talking about stick, I mean that we saw the players repeat the moves a few times, and now G3 and H4 presumably is gonna come. Yeah, for I like oh, also. Just, oh, he went F4. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. I like that move. Why not stopping H4 just to be sure? Some FG FG softens up the the king side. Okay. Getting rid of the double pawns as well. Quite nice. Move 33. Queen C. Stick. Actually, jokes Incoming. aside, um, White did control the pawns a little here, yeah? Like, they are somewhat blocked. It's, it's not, it doesn't look hopeless to me anymore. I see, I see how he could rook d1, how he could somehow Maxim can blunder. Oh, yeah, but there's knight f4. f4. I saw this trick with king, king g2. But uh, what is this trick? This is a it's great, a great trick. trick uh -huh. Takes queen g4. Yeah, oh, in fact, Maxim. the best move is actually play pawn takes knight. Anything yeah, else will yeah. lose. Probably it's a draw then, so he has okay, to play queen e3. Knight d3. Yeah, knight comes into d3. What a game by Maxim, by the way, yeah. uh, from a human viewpoint. Just a great play. Fantastic. Okay, Rook moves to b1. And uh, okay, now he's under yes. a minute. Six, You're happy with so endgames when this uh, c pawn is running. Bishop mm -hmm. on the 6 controls everything, dominates the f3 knight. So, yeah, complete control for Rook b7, last chance. Go for the endgame. Yep. Yeah. Rook b7 ah, on the board. Good one. Okay. Because well, fe will be very nice. It will, the pawn yeah, will control no. the d pawn. No, you only have one passer to deal with. Yeah, it's still business. Chances, chances, mm -hmm. chances. C three, rook c seven. It's not okay, queen but, but you uh -huh. can play bishop b b two. Yeah, but I will stop mm. you on c two probably anyway. Yeah, but then I go then around. D4. I will sit on d four. Yeah, mm. but the the, the a two pawn is ah. up for grabs. Is there no knight e one trick after bishop b two? Okay, f played, rook c seven, knight b four. Yeah, I consider that a three knight c two. Yeah. Problem why it's still not winning anywhere. You know, like. Knight, knight d4, d4, even if you take and take on a2. And? Yeah. You're stuck, or you just will move the king up, mm. yeah? The board and probably the hold up it. a3, a2, and maybe white holds, but nothing. Yeah, more. yeah, yeah, knight c1 check will always be there. Knight e1. Knight e1. But a2 yes to win. pawn. Just take the pawn. Oh, this is, is nice. Nasi and bishop g3. The double attack. Yeah. Oh, very yeah. nice. No, it's just it's very sharp, Maxim. Yeah, Today like, is yeah. just in a great form. Yeah. He got in the zone, I guess, in the, on the rest day, getting ready to play Magnus with his prep. And, and now completely, uh, completely on fire. Bishop takes pawn. But okay, this is bad news for Magnus. He's now lost like three Armageddons. This could be the fourth, fourth in a row. Fourth, yeah. fourth in a row. Okay, King defends the knight. Uh, so, fourth in a row? What? If you lose row. this one, it's four in a row. He lost, he lost all Armageddons pretty much. Yeah. So. Uh -huh. This is absolutely insane. He lost to Wesley, to Vichy. That's an insane uh -huh. piece of stat. Wow. To Ariane. Uh, to Ariane. And, and now, this, uh, I mean, now uh -huh. this one. Anyone losing all our Magadons is weird, but like the best player. Okay. And this is uh, very, very. Wait, 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 wait. Still the pawn. There's a. You sure? Is it in time? Seconds. Wait, is it in time? No, but guys, is, ah, C2 he's check. C2 time. check is there. What in the meta? What's C2? Ah, even can be one. Can be one. Can be one and then. H3. No, like King H2. Take C2 and then C2. Yes, and then C2. I thought can be one C2 and then H3, but yeah, the. Huh. Okay, so he's Rook actually B1. played yeah. Rook B1. Yeah, he doesn't Ooh. look happy about it. Yeah, because Touch piece. Touch piece is going to move it. Okay, Rook yeah. B1. Again, there are these intermezzo tricks. And too many pawns, probably the king can join one of them. So king point. F6, it's not like you have a win. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. King F6 king play, F6. wow, he's really precise. King yeah. B3, you just... King E5 or what? H3 can still run. Oh, 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 oh the bar says no. The bar says no? I know what happened. <clears throat> Night before, the computer is not a fan of. Now it says it's winning. Oh Rook my god! One. It's such an unfair oh, game. Oh, oh. oh, he could have got, got, given a check and taken the pawn. He let the seat. Oh, oh, that's why they both. They, they both missed that. That's yeah, why yeah. they both went for it. Okay. Yeah. But is it what is going? On? It still looks kind of half winning. Bar jumped again. Apparently. Oof. How is this winning? Do Look at his clock, though. Look, he has two seconds. Two, yeah, he's he has no time, time at all. Yeah. It, but he, okay, he will go forward with the king. And Magnus has to find it. No, but it's, it's waiting for what? King g3? King g4? Um, king e2. King g3? And I guess check. 
check. And yeah. king f2. Rook g1 check and king f2. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yes. King oh, yes. King yeah, yeah, yeah. He'll find yeah. it. He'll find it. Oh. Oh, he has one minute, 45 around. seconds. That extra three minutes now to calculate. Yeah, it's yeah. also such an easy line. You bring the king closer and then you give the rook g1 check. You cut off the king and it's very mm -hmm. easy. He'll find it eventually. So. What happened here earlier? Because it said c2, Sounds king c3, fair. it said it's a draw Such here. A good game. h3, still a draw, king c2, resigned. and, and only move king this f5. Is insane, by the way. And he's, wow. I've never and seen he's a resigned. more, more uh, lucky.